Hello guys, welcome to another video. Uh, yesterday I was trying to make the orange pie um, zero work with Wi-Fi and it didn't have uh, the drivers for the Wi-Fi and that's why it couldn't show the, the configuration menu to configure it. Uh, but now I discovered why it wasn't working. Uh, what happened is that I downloaded um, an operating system with kernel 6.1 well not, not this one actually but uh, I downloaded this one Armbian Bookworm with kernel 6.1 and uh, when I read some uh, for forums for the Armbian project um, people report that uh, bookworm 61330 Wi-Fi don't work um, it doesn't work because the, the drivers are not finished for uh, Linux version 6 um, but I tried to to install a Linux version 5 um, it's not available in the in the web page but if you go to this path here, uh, Armbian TNA hosting.net, archive, Orange Pi Zero archive, then you can find all the old um, Orange Pi Zero operating systems. Uh, what I advise is to download um, Bullseye Current 5 and then look at the uh, status bar here um, uh, 5.15.93 uh, underscore minimal uh, dot img dot xz it's this one it's from the February of 2003 and I have it downloaded here and I wrote it on the on the card with Balina Etcher and I have it in the in the micro SD card already and I'm going to show you how it works. Let's power it up. And we will not see the initial configuration questions um, that I showed you yesterday because it's already the, the second time I put this, R, this um, Orange Pi Zero. Let's log in. And when there are Wi Fi drivers, then I'm able to do type sudo nmtui network manager text user interface and then I go activate a connection and then we see many more options uh, yesterday I showed you that we we have this wire connection available to activate uh, right now it's uh, it's disconnected but now we have these options and these are all the Wi-Fi's that are available in your house and now we can act deactivate it and now we will activate it again connecting and it's activated and now we edit that connection edit edit and here we can go down and type the the Wi-Fi password okay now back and then quit and then IPA 
to show the addresses available in the in for Linux and we see that it has a created address uh, I mean, it has configured the Wi-Fi with address 192.168.1.144 so now we are able to ssh roberto at 192.168.1.144 okay um, now I'm going to, to run a speed test and let's see how fast this uh, wireless interface can download and upload Okay, we got six megabytes megabits per second and uh, ten megabits per second. Uh, that's actually better than I remember. And now we're going to plug the Ethernet and repeat the test. Let's see if it gets a an address automatically and uh, yes it got an address and now we're going to repeat the test We see that with Ethernet we get download speed of 31 megabits per second and upload speed of 17 megabits per second. Uh, that is going to change based on the time of day, time of day and network congestion. Uh, I don't know why it has chosen a, an ISP server from Taipei or from yeah from Taipei. I don't know what's going on. Uh, okay, I'm going to pause this video. Um, the next, in the next part of the video, we will use a Linux 6.1 because that's where, where I know that the audio and video works. Um, the audio will probably, probably work with a Linux 5, but the video definitely needs a Linux 6. Okay, we are back. Um, I'm going to show you how to use the Orange Pi Zero to play sounds and show video. Uh, first with the, with the video. Uh, if you use um, one of the latest operating systems available in Arbian.com, then video is already uh, enabled by default. Um, first I'll show you here uh, what file is is critical to enable video. If you type sudo nano put Arbian environment.txt then you can scroll down and see TVE. This is what activates the encoder inside the H3 chip and also add this word analog codec and that will enable the the analog to the, the digital to analog uh, converter inside the h3 uh, let's exit with control x and uh, don't save it and now i have this um this cable which i made it's made from the from a 
yellow, red and white uh, audio video cable and uh, this is for the ground uh, all the ground lines have been joined together uh, the yellow is for video the white is for left and the red one is for right side audio and here's what the other, en other end of the cable looks like uh, it's plugged into my TV on the video input uh, audio left and audio right side so when I connect this to the orange by zero we need to connect it according to the to the connection schematic uh, I'll show you in a second These are all the connections available in the Orange Pi Zero. Um, this first pin is this ground on the Orange Pi Zero. And these three pins are the uh, right, red, left, white, and video, uh, yellow. and I'm going to switch to my TV to show you that it's, it's showing something and you see that this is video coming from the Orange Pi Zero it has just started. Um, I'm going to leave it here for a second and while I connect the, the keyboard. Let's see, we'll connect the, we will connect the keyboard to the orange pie. see that it it's responding I'm going to log in uh, you can see it because there is an, an issue with the video output we have this issue of um, the the video goes beyond the top of the, the screen and uh, beyond the bottom of the screen. So I'm going to press enter until we see some some letters. Okay. And now um, I have programmed some some sounds so I can show you that it, it can play sounds. Let's go to the Let's, let's see the files that we have here. We have um, an mp3, a wave, and a mid file. And the other mid file doesn't work. So, to play sound, um, okay, a play, this file.
has played an mp3 file and now okay I was only able to play an mp3 and a wave file uh, so we will leave it like that right now um, but now I'll, sh I'll show you that we can do a, a graphic user interface here with the orange pi zero okay now we need to install the desktop manager lightdm the graphical server called uh, xserver.xorg and uh, X base, the most basic x11 apps uh, and some other packages sudo apt install uh, let's just copy paste it copy paste copy paste Let's see, uh, reboot orange by zero and you should see a graphical logging screen. Okay, let's try it. sudo reboot. something is happening nothing's happening oh 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 look at it look at that enter your password and we will do that I just need I just need to connect the, the keyboard on this USB port Okay, we're back. I got a second keyboard so that we, so that we don't have to share one keyboard in two uh, operating systems in two computers. So uh, now I can use this graphical login to login. Hope I got it right. Oh yes, I'm logging, logged in graphically. I need to fix some stuff. Okay, something that we needed is the um, the desktop. Um, it could be the L. XLDE desktop. Uh, let's install it. One hundred and sixty nine megabytes. Okay. Okay, the graphical desktop has already been installed and we have the login prompt on the serial port but uh, we need to see what's going on in the video port. Here I notice uh, some some options here. You can see that the, the mouse is working, and here we have these options: the way you want to use LXDE or OpenBox. Uh, default accession is what we had before, and uh, we'll try LXDE. Login. And we 
will see the NXT desktop and there it is uh, we still have the problem of problem of the overscan uh, but at least we have some desktop we have a terminal that we can resize and we have um, preferences I know that some of them don't work some of them do work but uh, we have confirmation that we have uh, a graphical user interface and let's try playing that music again a a play tap tap and where is that wave file wave file is the 696 696 and enter and let's play that mp3 and that file starts with uh, try to play that um, that MIDI file it will probably fail again the terminal says it's playing but there's no sound coming from the speakers okay I will stop here and next time uh, I'll show you how to use the open box um, desktop environment uh, it's a more um, uh, more streamlined and uh, we can do some tweaks to to, to make these um, margins uh, be corrected see you in the next video